ozone, a colorless, odorless gas, is the primary ingredient of smog. Though ozone occurs naturally well above the Earth to provide a protective layer against ultraviolet radiation, at ground level, ozone becomes increasingly harmful as concentrations rise. Experts have found that poor automobile maintenance is a main source of our air quality problems. Fortunately, steps taken to save yourself gas and money also help to improve the air. Here's more. Hi, I'm Matt Stull with Kentuckiana Air Education, the outreach program of the Louisville Metro Air Pollution Control District. Today's a summer day just like many that we have here in the Louisville Metro. Lots of sunshine and plenty of people are taking advantage by coming out to the park or maybe even taking a dip in the swimming pool. Unfortunately, air pollution causes many others to have to stay inside on days like this or even limit their activity. Here at the Louisville Metro Air Pollution Control District, we use information from sophisticated monitors along with weather data to come up with a daily air quality forecast. That information is then used to determine the air quality index for the following day. The air quality index provides guidelines to protect your health when ozone and particulate matter levels rise. For a few days each year, Louisville's forecast is in the unhealthy for sensitive groups range. That means that during high levels of pollution, active children and adults and people with lung disease such as asthma or heart disease should avoid prolonged or heavy exertion outdoors. Everyone else should reduce prolonged or heavy exertion outdoors. You've probably read articles using long terms like ground level ozone, particulate matter, or volatile organic compounds. Words like these make air pollution seem like a difficult business, but in reality, the solution is very easy and involves you. Poorly maintained vehicles are a major source of air pollution. You can help our community breathe easier by paying more attention to your car's maintenance. And fortunately, the steps taken to save gas and money help the air. Here's how easy it can be to help with your car. Handle the pressure. Keep your vehicle's tires properly inflated. Care for your car. Regular maintenance and tune-ups can improve gas mileage, extend your car's life, and increase its resale value. Stay on schedule. Save gas and protect the air by changing your vehicle's oil and air filters regularly. Put out the light. Your vehicle's check engine light lets you know about a possible mechanical problem. A proper diagnosis and repair can help the air and save you money in the long run. Refuel when it's cool. Refuel during the evenings or early in the morning when the air is cooler. Stop at the click. Topping off your tank releases gas fumes into the air and cancels the benefits of the pump's anti-pollution devices. Lock it down. Tighten your gas cap until it clicks to keep gas from evaporating. Replace gas caps that don't seal properly. Driving habits. Know before you go. Get traffic updates before you leave home and you won't get stuck in a jam. Drive less by combining and or planning your errands. Avoid idling to keep from wasting gas. There are alternatives to driving when an air quality alert has been issued. Brown bag it. Instead of driving to a restaurant for lunch, bring your lunch, organize an office potluck, or order one lunch delivery for a group. Share a ride by carpooling or riding the bus. Drive alternative fuel vehicles. Hybrids that combine gas and electric power are becoming more and more popular. There are also vehicles that can run on ethanol, a cleaner fuel to burn. Get exercise. Walking or riding a bike on short trips will save gas and the air. You can also help the air in your yard. Low maintenance landscaping helps you landscape your yard to reduce the use of gas-powered lawn equipment. Minimize grass while planting shrubs, native plants, wildflowers, ground covers, and more that need little maintenance, pesticides, and herbicides. For all of these tips and more, check out our website at helptheair.org. That's helptheair.org. Ground level ozone forms readily during hot, sunny weather. That's why we're more likely to have higher concentrations of ozone during the summer months. 
For more information on how you can help our community to breathe easier, visit helptheair.org. Metro TV, a public service of Louisville Metro Government.